Hi guys, this is Kay here, and welcome back to another Candid K Convos. We are now nice and snug in the month of July, during one of the hottest months for us here in America. Us talking about me, or everyone. Anyway, <laughs> it's really hot, and not the fun hot, but that's not why I'm here to talk, other than the obvious rambles that I'll be having whenever I do these kinds of videos. I do try and have at least a little bit of structure as to what I want to talk about, sometimes. <laughs> so, I recently-ish made a post about the fact that construction has returned and all this stuff's been happening, so I haven't been able to make videos. And in that same post, I said I was actually thinking I would be able to make more videos. And then, if you guys kept up, You'll have seen that I did post one video, and then nothing else. The reason behind that is because, well, more stuff happened. Construction. Still happening. And not only is it happening just like roadside, roadside? Road construction. Not only is that going on, but next door neighbors are going at it again with the hammers and the drills at 7 a.m. waking everybody up in the neighborhood. And now you would think that's not as bad as I would think because, you know, people usually stop construction at um, five, six at the latest. But, but, while that is true, due to it being kind of 4th of July, along with the protests still going on around here in my city, people have been throwing around, okay, I don't know about throwing around, but, you know, they've been setting off fireworks and or shooting guns not like at each other thankfully i would hope but more like in the air due to protests and it being america and people just probably wanting to let out a lot of the frustration they've been holding in because of quarantine not even gonna lie that just crossed my mind and i mean you know frustration pent up, it'll make people really want to go out. Now, I could go into that whole thing, but I'm not going to because I'm not really a political person. But no matter what that, you know, is, it's sadly the, the shots or the fireworks going off. It's getting in the way of my abilities because it happens all throughout the day and all throughout the night until maybe 5 or 6 a.m. only for it to be picked up again at like 7, 8, maybe 9.30 in the morning and well it's not consistent it's not a, like, constant boom, boom, you know, shot, shot noise, but it's at random times, so it's very hard sometimes to be able to get a good, clean take, even if it's a short one. It's really hard to get in one good take, because those would just go off at any time, 
And unfortunately, it's actually going on now. A little farther away than usual, but if you guys hear little bumps randomly during this video, that's why. Or that's what that is. So that's why I haven't really been doing many videos lately. Because even with any background silencing my microphone, it does still pick it up. So, either, you know, that my microphone is just too good at picking up small things, or I'm just dumb, which is probably <laughs> more likely. But either way, I'm really sorry that there haven't been as many videos lately. I really want to get more videos out there to you guys. And I hope you know that. Don't worry, I'm not burned out. If anything, I'm just burned out from the neighbors or whoever keeps firing whatever they're firing. And I do hope it stops soon. Because I have so many ideas. So many things I want to create and share with you. I mean... You guys voted on the dreams, as opposed to me talking about mythology. I'm really excited to talk about the first dream that I have. And I'm not going to spoil it. But, if I were to give a hint, this one would be about finding a way to help bring a broken heart, um, a broken hearted spirit to rest, and it's a very sad story to begin with, but trust me, it's, well, based on how I'm writing it, I hope it's really good to listen to. And now you might be thinking, wait a second, Kay, you don't write? Okay, that sounds bad. You don't write scripts. What are you talking about? True. Unless I'm doing a collaboration, I don't write my scripts. I actually improv everything. I almost forgot the word there. Everything I say is improv. I have what I want to say in my head, and then I say it. But in terms of sharing dreams, that's a completely different story, and that is why dream videos are only going to be once a month, because I'm going to have to sit and write out an entire story for you guys to read. Maybe it won't be word for word, like a once upon a time there was a dot 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 type of story. But it'll still be something I have to write out. Otherwise, due to the many, many details that I have in all of my vivid dreams, what usually would be what I'd imagine to be like, I don't know, 20 minutes worth of video, that'll turn into an hour, hour and a half. And that is very, very long. And I don't know if you guys would be down to hear that. I also go on a lot of tangents, so having to write something like a script almost for something like this, sharing a dream, as opposed to expressing my thoughts and feelings on certain topics, all of which, if you can't tell already, is more on the understanding positive side. It's very different, and I don't want to mess up the dreams by either going too off tangent or not even really going anywhere in terms of telling a story. Don't worry though, the dreams I share, not only are they all mine, but they're all 
incredibly unique, different, and vivid. Now, I will tell you right now that it's not the dreams. They're not in any way, shape, or form close to what my normal audios are. As I would assume you know, or for those who don't know and who are new, first off, hi. Um, they're very calming, relaxing, um, encouraging, everything like that. Those are my roleplay videos, the ASMR. And sure, my dream videos are going to be in ASMR format, if you could call it that. However, it's not so much that type of ASMR, it's more me telling you as if we're sitting across each other from a table or something and we're drinking coffee tea lemonade whatever you feel like drinking and eating chips or something it's basically just me telling you what i dreamt about as if we're just hanging out talking and sharing you know our memories. So it's not going to be anything like the normal videos I make. And I really, really hope you guys like it. I'm really excited because, again, there's so many dreams that I have that it's going to actually be a challenge to pick out which ones to share. But, I'll figure it out. And maybe I'll make some polls for you guys to help me decide if I can't choose between one dream or another. But, that's one of the things that I'm really excited to start up. Don't worry, I'm going to continue on with the, uh, the flowers, angel, and demon role plays. Things have just been, like I said, a little crazy. And my normal work has actually started back up too. For those who need a tiny recap, I work in retail. And now that stores are slowly being opened again, I'm back out there. Don't worry, I'm being very, very careful wearing masks washing my hands vigorously, constantly. But, yes, that is happening again. And we'll see what happens with that. Other than that though, I'm really, really excited to see what else happens terms of videos. I have more ideas and a lot of great stories and some pretty interesting, maybe interactable projects that are coming up. Some may be really soon, some may be a good little ways away. But either way, I hope that you guys enjoy it when it comes out. In the meantime though, remember that you're all amazing in your own way. You're great, wonderful, and remember that while it is absolutely crazy right now, what's going on in the world, remember that you, we, as a community, as a human race, we're very strong. We've come out the other side from crazier things. All we need to do is to stick together, work together, 
and support each other and you know, just strive towards being a stronger, kinder, more accepting and understanding people. I really hope that you guys remember that and that you are all loved by and cared for by me. If not also by those who are also in this community. And yes, I think I've said it in the other videos, but I'm still trying to come up with a name for you guys. I'll think of one eventually, but for now, I'm just calling you guys my friends, my wonderful friends and family. Take care, everyone. Remember that while this is a really just difficult time, that we can make it out the other side. We're strong. And everything will be okay in the end. I hope you guys have a wonderful day or night, no matter where you're from. And I will see you all in the next video.